right, we're on day six, just showing the weather. I'm currently hiking that 1.2 mile spur trail from the camp shelter at Whitley all the way to back to the main trail. And I'm just laughing because I remember last night like sprinting down this trail, screaming slash laughing. We were in the middle of lightning and <laughs> just wanting to find the shelter so bad. We were just practically running. And when we found it, we just screamed for joy. And it was amazing. But now we reap the consequences walking back up for a little over a mile. And we'll talk to you soon. Okay, I wanna show you this so cool. We're like in the clouds right now, but the sun is starting to come through. And I'm so excited because we've just been having crazy weather, but here the clouds receding. It's probably so freaking windy on here. I'm gonna flip the camera around. All right, you can kind of see some mountaintops way over there, but we're just directly in these fast moving clouds. So cool. And here's the blue blaze, which is telling us that's what we followed to get off trail and find the shelter. So when you're on the trail, they're white. And then if there's a blue blaze, it's leading you off trail to something important, either a shelter, water, something good like that. So here's another one. Just making sure you're headed in the right direction. We'll be out of here soon. People call the AT the green tunnel, like it's a bad thing, but I am loving some vegetation. The colors are beautiful. We're happy to be here. A little sloshy, a little wet today. All right, we made it. Whitley Gap Shelter, 1.2 miles. We came from that way yesterday. So we'll go that way now. Oh yeah, here we go. It's about 9.30, just taking a break. Here's my snack for the morning. Some protein cookie. <laughs> The diet out here is interesting. You know, you just eat whatever you have. And when you re, when I stocked up on food, I, it was frantic. I just was like, okay, what do you got? Cookies, grab them. Muffins, grabbed them. Clip bars, grabbed them. Loose peanut butter, grabbed it. Like no plan. So next time I have to refill my food pack, I'm definitely going to get a little plan in place because we are not even that good like it looks good it's not that good so i'm just gonna since i've been hiking about three miles i've stopped i'm gonna do a snack stretch drink a bunch of water um i've been doing that and i haven't had any physical issues so knock on wood i will um keep going. It's a beautiful day. Talk to you soon. All right, going to do a little water filtration demonstration.
So that's really all there is to it. This thing right here is the filter that you saw. Looks like this. You just shake it to clean it. And what I like to do when there's water is just drink one liter and then bring one with me the rest of the way until we get more. Coming down into Low Gap, I just wanted to show the views. It's just like mountains and mountains and mountains and mountains. Ugh. So pretty. So Just want to show the trail a little bit before we get to camp. It's so rocky. It's just pretty much all rocks as we go up. It's slow and steady. Okay, in addition to this rocks, look at this like hill of moss. It just keeps going and going and going. It's so pretty out here. Kind of dead over here. Got some mountains. This is, this is today. Whew, almost to camp, about a mile and a half. It's the end of day six, and today was our longest day yet, about 13.3 miles. It was beautiful weather. It's going to be cold tonight, so just in the tent. Um, tomorrow will probably be another long one. We have some climbs, but it'll be good. So far, so good. We're at Blue Mountain Shelter, and there's a lot of people here, but... I think with the wind, it's just going to be so loud tonight. <laughs> so probably a headphone kind of night. But we will talk to you tomorrow.